Okay, YouTube, JL Chambers 82. Uh, as you can see, Neo Geo CD is still plugged in, still running. Uh, I'm going to get this started. This is Samurai Spirits 3, and this is going to be another quick, real quick video. Uh, don't want to spend a whole lot of time on this series. This, this completes uh, my collection of uh, the Samurai Spirits or the Samurai Showdown. <coughs> I'm sorry, there are other games uh, out there. I believe there is Samurai uh, Showdown 4 and also, you know, the Samurai Showdown 64, and uh, for the Neo Geo CD exclusively, there is Samurai uh, Showdown RPG, which even though I don't speak Japanese, I'm going to get that game, and I will learn Japanese, and I will play that game one day, because uh, it looks badass, it looks really, really cool. Uh, Luke Morrison 1 does a really cool video on it, if you want to check it out, uh, just to see what it looks like, but I wish they would have uh, released an English translation of it, because it looks really cool. This is uh, my least favorite that I, uh, of the games that I own and that I've played in the series, even though, the, as you can tell, the, uh, the artwork's going to be fantastic on this. So this is just a little uh, preview of what it's going to look like. The art is very different in this game, but the speed and everything is really, really cool. But yeah, the, there's, there's Galford, uh, and he looks a lot different. Uh, so I've always been a fan of uh, Awamaru, if I'm saying that correctly. Um, but in this in this game, he's definitely got some wicked hair. But uh, yeah, the menus are a little different, and the screens are a little different, and everything. But um, yeah, it's just it, it, it's my least favorite, I guess. I don't know. There's just something different about the feel of the game. Um, I think the, the, at, at its core, the mechanics are still there. But uh, um, I think this was maybe just a little bit too ambitious, you know, as far as like you know, it kind of it was a little bit of a t departure from the series. And if I remember correctly, like I said, uh, Samurai Spirits 2, or Samurai Shodown 2, got really, really good reviews in all the uh, game magazines back in the day. And this one, I remember, was not, you know, favored as much. Like, uh, I thought it got bad reviews and people bashed it, but I just don't think it, people liked it as much. And, uh, anyway, some cool artwork, definitely. But yeah, as you can tell already, it's a little bit different on the animation. Zoom's not as intense, I guess. You know, too. Like, it doesn't zoom out as much. It's kind of closer in. And I'm going to be pretty shitty at this one. This, this game's tough, too, man. Like, they vamped up the difficulty on this. Like, you've got to be real smart about your about your uh, attacks on this game. But again, uh, great soundtrack. I like to a lot better, though. The, the music's really, really cool. Uh, it's more traditional. Uh, Samurai Spirits 1, the music is very, very much so, like, uh, it uh, focuses on, like, traditional Japanese instruments and everything. Here we have a little mix of that and uh, some, some rock and, you know, some modern, more modern soundtrack, I guess, but... Ugh, damn it. Yeah, but it's uh, still a cool game. Uh, it's, it's still fun, so, I mean, definitely, uh, you know... Considering that these games are not rare, not, you know, they make plenty of them, I would definitely, uh, you know, pick them up. Um, I intend on getting every uh, Samurai Spirit or Samurai Shodown game I can, you know, that, that, that they made for the, the CD system. And once I get, you know, an AES system, finally, I'll do the same on the cartridges. But real quick, I'll show you another character, I guess. This guy's pretty big. Yeah, you can play the boss. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Uh, But yeah, a little bit more modern with the yeah, you pick the normal or the or the like the turbo mode and everything. But uh, look, time it's 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 the worst. It, I'm sorry, that's terrible grammar. It's um, it's the worst out of all of them. Um, but it's still not that bad. And if you had a CDZ system, all these games are gonna play really really well. So um, if you've got a CDZ system, there's no reason not to pick up all these games because they're gonna be twenty thirty dollars a piece on eBay even. You know, a lot cheaper than the cartridges, and for the load time, uh, I think it's totally worth it. You're gonna get the better soundtrack and everything on this on the CD. Yeah, this guy's pretty big and pretty badass. Yeah, not so much a samurai, but has a big strain of beads and bludgeons the shit out of uh, everybody with. But yeah, I don't know, like, if you saw that, the animation's kind of, it's kind of stiff, comparatively speaking, to the other ones. Um, 
So maybe, I don't know, maybe that's it. I don't know. There's something about it, though, that I just don't like as much as one and two. Uh, two, I don't know if two is necessarily my favorite. It's my favorite to play on the, on the, on the system. But I do like two a lot. I mean, uh, one a lot on uh, the 3DO and on, on the, uh, the Neo Geo C system. But two stays in the Neo Geo C uh, system more than anything. But there you go. Yeah, not, he's not necessarily a samurai, but he just fucking kicked the shit out of American Ninja, so... Anyway, YouTube, this is uh, CMR Spirits 3. Post questions, comments. Uh, if you guys know some other uh, games in the series I should be checking out and a, w and a way for me to play them, definitely let me know. Post questions, comments, anything you got. Insults. Bring it on. Anyway, YouTube, uh, focusing on some new videos soon. Game pickups, things like that. Just wanted to, get to show off these while I had the uh, Neo Geo out. So, later.